Good morning, students. I'm sure you all are taking a good, good care of yourself and your parents and your studies. Okay, so I'm just going to give one assignment today, a very short one. Okay, yes. So before that, let us try to see uh, what are the things that we have done so far. Okay, yes. So uh, you have to keep in mind that uh, the first time when we started Google Classroom, okay, yes, the Google Classroom started in July, okay, yes. Uh, before that, when the lockdown started, we have already given you lots and lots of assignments, and I'm sure you all have those assignments uh, which you recorded in your notebook or rough book like this, okay. Now you should be having all the uh, what you say assignments with you. Okay, now when we talk about the online class, that online classes started maybe in July. Okay, yes. So when the online started, when online class started, I've just given you a few exercises. I remember my very first exercise given to you was just to get some idea uh, how many students are using the Google Classroom and how, how many of you are what you see submitting the assignment you got it so uh, if i remember my first uh, which the assignment in the google classroom okay google classroom was how was your okay yes how was your english assignment going yes so that was my very first assignment in the google class i've got mainly two reasons the first reason is to check how many of you are using the google classroom and second one how many of you are able to which you see do the assignment and send it to me either through whatsapp or google classroom so that was the thing okay and many of the students have come up with assignment okay what you have to do you have to just write one paragraph and you have to tell me how's your english assignment going on okay yes i know uh, there is lockdown you don't have any classes but that is that does not become an excuse okay even if there is no what you will say regular classes it's important as a student to keep in touch with your subject and the present subject we are talking about is english which is a language okay so i just want to get some idea uh, how you are keeping in touch with your english assignment okay yes so some of the students uh, which are they are which are following all the assignment some of them have done all the assignment and some of them are still uh, in the middle of the assignment whatever okay my main purpose was just to get some idea how's your english assignment going on okay there is no hurry at all i know it's a very critical condition going on so i can understand we all have our own problems okay yes but keep in mind that you have to do all the assignment okay you have got all of time okay yes so that was my very first assignment given to you okay yes now uh, we are talking about english language now as far as english language is concerned i'm not that first very strict with all the lessons because it's a language and when it comes to language, we are basically talking about the reading, writing, speaking, listening, and which I'm sure you all are doing. You must be watching some videos or movies. You must be writing your diary. You must be reading some books. So all these four skills are related to you. Okay, yes. So uh, there's no need for me to worry that much. Okay, both uh, Gyanla. Okay, yes. There's no need for us to worry about uh, your English assignment okay yes now what we have to uh, which would you say worry and what we have to uh, keep in mind is our literature part okay yes so literature part although there are so many resources there are so many resources in the internet okay we have also given the YouTube link of all the lessons that we have okay yes so when it talks about literature so far I have just uploaded 
three lessons. Okay, I have uploaded three lessons when we started our online class. Okay, if you remember, uh, one poem lesson and two prose lesson. One is from uh, Beehive textbook and the other one is from your moment's textbook okay yes so i have uploaded three lessons and uh, many of you are which is submitting you are doing your own assignment and i'm not giving you a very lengthy assignment exercises okay all i'm requesting you is make sure you watch this make sure you understand the lesson and uh, as far as the exercises are concerned i used to give a short exercise and if you've got more time you can come up with your any kind of exercise as long as you do some exercises related to the videos you have watched it's more than enough you got it so that is the thing that you have to keep in mind okay yes so that is the thing okay yes and recently, I mean, uh, the previous week, I just gave you one assignment, very important. I gave you a choice whether you do written assignment or you do oral presentation. You have to choose one, okay? And I've given you a time uh, limit one whole week, okay? Yes. So many of the students have come up with your oral presentation. You have done a short video, which was very good. I'm sure you have learned so many things, uh, recording the video and presenting yourself before the camera. Now, actually, these are the things that is very important. The final product may not come good or uh, what should you say, very nice one. But what is important is the process. The process is important while recording you must have done lots and lots of practice before presenting that you must have written so many drafts you have practiced reading now these are the things which i am interested okay your final product may not be very good okay and i also told you that i'm going not going to share it in the uh, virtual social network all these things will be in the safe custody of uh, what should I say myself okay there's no need for you to worry about the videos okay there's no need for you to worry that I will share this in the public uh, which we say domain no okay yes so I'm receiving assignment uh, some of the students have written essay okay in the essay I gave you two topic you have to choose one very good okay and uh, before writing an essay I also gave you one link okay I told you to do the writing process which is very important whenever you have got some writing it's important for you to do the writing process okay if you are not in the habit of doing writing process i request you to first do writing process you just follow all the process and then you just check it yourself whether a writing process helps you or not if it helps then you continue if it does not help then leave it you just continue with your own style okay yes so in your written, uh, I told you to uh, follow the uh, writing process. Okay. Yes. And in the oral presentation, I told you, you have to come up with any topic you like. Okay. Yeah. I've given you lots and lots of uh, freedom. Okay. You can choose. And then uh, when you face your camera or I also requested you to share your presentation with your family members during lunchtime or dinner like this. They will help you so through this you will learn so many things and remember what if whatever we are doing they are all related to english you got it so these two the these two exercises okay yes uh, you have to either uh, do one of yes okay yes and uh, the time limit is almost over okay yes so but don't worry if you are which you say uh, if you want to upload uh, if you want to share it with me if you want to submit make sure that you uh, what should I say send all your assignment to me okay yes either through whatsapp or uh, through the google classroom okay yes so today I'm just going to give you one small assignment okay yes what is that small assignment okay yes it's very simple you will know okay what is my assignment? My assignment is write the names of all the books 
you have read during this lockdown. Did you understand? It's very simple. Okay. Uh, what you have to do, you have to write the names of all the books you have read during this lockdown. Okay. It says, it's only during the lockdown. Even if you have written, read only two, it's okay. I want you to be sincere. I just want you to be true. Okay. Don't try to uh, write the names of the books, even if you haven't read. Okay. Make sure that you write all the books, even if you read only one, it's okay. I just want you to just think about all the things that you have read. Okay. Good. So write the names of all the books you have read during this lockdown. Okay. Yes. You just write the names of the books one two three okay yes and you send it to me either in google classroom or uh, through whatsapp okay yes so that is the assignment did you understand so this assignment will take just one day okay yes so the second thing that i want to say is now it has been long time since we didn't do any uh, what should i say uh, zoom class okay yes zoom or google uh, class google hangout okay yes so what we are going to do on wednesday okay yes on wednesday so that is tomorrow okay yes tomorrow we have got class eight and we have got class nine one in the morning and one in the afternoon so wednesday what we are going to do we are going to do our very first google meet did you understand so I'm going to conduct one Google Meet. I'm going to share the link. I will invite you. Okay. So we will just uh, see. Okay. I hope to see uh, many of you. Okay. Yes. So what we are going to do, we are just going to discuss uh, some of the problems you face. What are the things that we should be doing in the next uh, couple of weeks. Okay. We are going to basically talking. We'll be talking about our problems, solution, and if there, if there is any suggestion, okay, about the online class, so you can also share. Understood? So that is the main reason why I make this video. So tomorrow, Wednesday, okay, we will have a Google Meet. Okay. I will share the link. One in the morning, one in the afternoon. So class eight and class nine. Did you understand? Now, as for today, I've already given you one assignment. What is that? You have to write the name of all the books that you have read during your lockdown. It's very simple. Okay. Yes. And uh, I want you to keep in touch with your own uh, literature. Okay. Yes. Now, as far as the reading and writing, uh, speaking, this thing is concerned, all these things are already there. Okay. Now it's important for us to do all the literature part. Okay. Yes. So I'll be trying to cover all the literature parts in the coming week. In the same, uh, in the meantime, you just also try to watch all the videos. Okay. Yes. So that is the thing. And if you get some time, uh, you remember every Monday and Tuesday uh, from 9.30, okay, till uh, 12.30, uh, there will be a uh, live English online class through Tibet TV. Okay. Yes. It comes in uh, Facebook and uh, what should I say? You can also, if you miss those live session, you can also go to uh, Tibet TV YouTube. Okay. There are so many lessons. Okay. And we are not teaching any lesson from a textbook. Okay. We are teaching English. Okay. The main English, uh, what should I say? Uh, linguistic structure okay all the general part okay of english and all these topics are very much related to you although these are not related to your textbook but i'm sure if you go through all the videos there are so many things you can learn okay yes so that is the thing so i'm going to stop here and i'll see you in the google meet so till then take care okay and if you've got any question and suggestion and doubt so please try to write that and try to share it tomorrow during the Google Meet. Understood? Thank you.